Shepard, I heard about Thessia. We were so close, Anderson. So damn close to ending this war. You didn't think it'd be that easy, did you? I knew going in there wouldn't be a minute of this war that was easy. But watching Thessia fall, and knowing it was my responsibility... Shepard, you know how many times I got my ass handed to me over the years? Surviving the first contact war back in the day was a goddamn miracle. They said I was a hero. I just felt lucky to get out alive. So maybe Kai Lang did beat you. What of it? It could cost us the war. These guys in the Resistance, they know it's a losing proposition. They know the chances of seeing tomorrow are slim to none. But we all signed up anyway. Hell, I'm sitting in London right now staring at rubble. I was born here. And it's looking like I might die here, too. So I say point us at the Reapers and we'll take our chances. You'll make it, Anderson. And when this is all over, you can show me London. <laughs> it might need a new coat of paint first. This'll be over soon. It better. Shake this off, Shepard. I will. Anderson out. Thanks for listening, Commander. It was a good idea. And right now, it's the best lead we've got. In any event... Good luck. So, Thessia, huh? I guess the Asari are wishing they had fewer dancers and more commandos right about now. Too soon? In case you hadn't noticed, we just lost a few million people. This isn't the time. You see this? Tip tree. Little colony out in the ass end of nowhere. My dad lives there. So does my sister. Reapers rolled in about two weeks ago. So you can assume that I'm generally aware there's a war on Commander. So why the jokes? Because Edie says that according to your armor's metabolic scans, you're under more stress now than during the Skillian Blitz. Like more than Elysium, where it was pretty much you versus 10,000 Batarians trying to kill you. And the last time I had a briefing with Anderson, he told me to take care of you. The guy leading the resistance on Earth is worried about you. And I'm supposed to help. I appreciate the thought, Joker. But I'm fine. The hell you are. You're like half robot at this point. No offense, Edie. And it's my fault. When the Collectors blew up the first Normandy, you died because I wouldn't leave. Because you had to come back for me. Couldn't leave the best pilot in the fleet behind, could I? Yeah, well, I guess that would have looked bad on your report. Come on. We've got work to do. Shepard, I have a question about human behavior. This isn't the best time, Edie. Perhaps humor? A penguin is driving through the Arizona desert. I'm not in the mood. A lively rendition of La Marseillaise? No. Very well. I will maintain a respectful silence until you indicate otherwise. Hey, for what it's worth, I know how it feels to lose like that. I know that doesn't make it easier, but... You're just human like the rest of us. If you're trying to make me feel better, it's not working, Lieutenant. Hey, everyone on this ship knows you did all you could. You need to cut yourself some slack. Whatever it takes to get that data back from Cerberus, we're behind you. Whatever it takes to end this. Noted. talking to Liara. She's a strong one. I'd say her world's just been completely rocked. Completely? Adams and I were just remembering Novaria and the terrible way her mother died. Liara seemed so together afterward. Couldn't have been easy. Mm. For weeks, she told me stories about her mother. Yeah, me too. I have a feeling she'll be okay. Yeah. Hope so. 
Nothing to report, Commander. I'm really glad she has you to comfort her. And don't worry about Kai Lang. Now that we've seen his dirty moves, next time, he's getting his ass kicked. Count on it. Can't wait to get back out there. That can't be true! You saw it with your own eyes. The goddess Athame was Prothean. You wanted to know more about your history, Asari. Now you do. I have a name. It's Liara Tassoni, and I'd have... Hey, settle down. My home was just destroyed, and all he can do is gloat. Given what's happened today, I think you owe Liara an apology, Javik. Apologize for the truth? For not doing more. You're a Prothean. You were supposed to have all the answers. How could you not stop this from happening? We believed you would. Long ago, we saw the potential in your people. Even then, it was obvious. The wisdom, the patience. You were the best hope for this cycle. So you were guided when necessary. Well, it didn't work. You're still alive, aren't you? Your world may have fallen. But as long as even one Asari is left standing, the fight isn't over. I guess that goes for Protheans, too. Despair is the enemy's greatest weapon. Do not let them wield it. Liara Tassoni. That was unexpected. Thank you. We still need her talents. If grief overcomes her, she will be lost to us. So did you actually mean what you said? Does it matter? Liara means a great deal to me. It matters. Then I will tell you what you want to hear. I meant what I said. Carry on. How did this happen, Shepard? Did I just assume the Asari would be ready? That the Council would protect them? Or was I so busy with the Catalyst that I ignored my own people? You'd never do that. They're dying by the millions! I told those people on Thessia we'd save them! How many Asari died because I demanded their help? None. Shepard, that isn't true. You've been warning your people for four years, Liara. There's not a damn thing you should feel guilty about. If we move fast enough, they'll have a chance to survive this, to start again. We lost Thessia, but we haven't lost the Asari yet. Helping the refugees. That's something I can do. It's something I owe them. I knew you'd think of something. I still need some time, Shepard. But thank you. <laughs>